Christmas uh, 23 and uh, not not much happiness here and so I uh, uh, published here as a I'm doing a first my first circuit board and and so um, next step would be to order and so uh, maybe you have some uh, suggestions for me or some help here uh, so uh, this is this nice uh, here I use it for from many projects here now this is a booster here with touch screen so I can turn off now the booster so this is, is only the hoverboard and that's uh, um, the, the wolf defender and 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 so yeah let's let's begin <coughs> uh, so yeah it's it's here really cheap it's um, with without the display so this is this pickup module and uh, and so it's I, I really um, would like to to have here and <laughs> a, a nice uh, a PCB with uh, here's the ESP32. This is a 3.5 millimeter. Uh, it's green because here in the PCB it's selected. And here, if uh, you uh, use this, this uh, small 3.5 milli headers, and here for the display, the 8.5 millimeters, a standard one, then uh, it just fits above. And, and so um, here I still uh, have this nice uh, jog dial, it's only 10 cent. Uh, uh, so uh, I sometimes I prefer a manual, you see with gloves in winter, and also here with, with this touch screen, uh, here it's, it's always. Uh, this uh, uh, it gets dirty, so I, I prefer here to to oops to, to switch here uh, to switch here with with my uh, a switch instead of the, using the touch screen. This is the only four four euro, the, the most cheap one, eight one point eight inch. Because here then uh, you can still let's go to autographic and I still uh, can. Uh, access these. Uh, this is a current, a constant current uh, output voltage, input voltage, and my trick to uh, to to manipul manipulate it is to <laughs> to use a DAC and a DAC here with a 10 kilo ohm. Simply going here uh, to this uh, potentiometer here, uh, then so you can add an offset, and so uh, that's. It depends on here the resistance. So if you choose one kilo ohm, then you could um, have a wider. Uh, if you make one kilo, uh, one hundred kilo ohm, then you could only choose a very small uh, uh, offset. Uh, and as this is uh, only two hundred fifty-five DAC, so uh, ten kilo ohm was what I did choose. Uh, a problem here. Um, okay, I had to add this uh, S to mini. Uh, I found out there's a nice uh, uh, guy who made a plug-in uh, here, uh, and, and so there's a, a library. You simply copy these files. It, it's explained here. I also added it here to my GitHub. Uh, where's the code? Uh, uh, so here in, in a Blender, uh, I, I also here added this this library. Uh, this is this nice S2 Mini. Ah, uh, yes, I wanted to show you here. Uh, uh, so uh, it's this is a dock dial, and here is my ESP32. It's always here with. Uh, let's go to a texture. So uh, I've made simply some images with a texture, and then it's quite easy here uh, to. Uh, to draw these things. Uh, if you um, make these custom models, you uh, should take care uh, that uh, it's easiest if it's symmetrical. So here it's always uh, zero, zero, zero. And you see that's exactly the middle point. So when you go to uh, this um, symbol editor, okay, now here it's this display. Then uh, it should also be the center, and if it's not, then you have to adjust it. So here, that's uh, uh, EFP30, this DC-DC hardware. Uh, 
Uh, and, and, and so this is exactly to the center, but uh, it's below minus 4.5 because uh, bro, here it's this, the symbol properties, you have to choose the footprint and in the footprint editor, uh, you see it's also the center, uh, but the, the module if you click here, double click, and then you have here the 3D models. Uh, size, size, size. You, you don't need to change here anything uh, here in the, the offset. If, if you see the offset is zero because the PCB is at, at, at zero and our oh, sun is coming up. And, and it gets a bit hotter because my hands are really cold. <laughs> Uh, you see that uh, center is here, so also already the uh, the PCB, I think, it is here, yeah, it's 14.5 minus, but here the, the header, it's minus 1.5, uh, because 1.5, that's the header. So uh, it's it's nice to uh, already uh, have the same uh, point of origin here, and then you uh, ex uh, export. A key card and you do not uh, origin to center uh, because then all uh, the objects that uh, get exported have to have to have the same origin that's not a nice because you see here you can immediately see this is a two point uh, one centimeters below and and so it's it's better to have to for designing it to have um, the origin where the object uh, has it and not the final. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, yeah, this uh, uh, somewhere the user preference and then the add-ons, and there you um, if you have copied the files into uh, here, then you have to activate it here and and, and save and and then you uh, oops, no, we don't, uh, and then it shows up here in the export settings. Yeah, this uh, module here um, <laughs> has uh, lots of GND because it's only for the stability of this display here. Uh, and so uh, ba I would I need uh, some some more um, pins from from this uh, nice DC DC. That's why I have added here uh, this header. I have to add so you see this five volt and GND. Uh, coming from here to the left, this uh, thing. Uh, but then here's this potential meter for the output because this was uh, designed for MPPT, so it's only uh, having access to the uh, potential meter of the input voltage. So the output voltage, uh, you can see here. Uh, <laughs> you see, I, I had to edit manually, and, and, and so here's this. this, 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 this five volt and and then there's this mode pin uh, um, you you should uh, disconnect it here and then you could access a mode pin here and if it is set to ground then it allows for back current which is needed here for 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 the booster because uh, when when I break, uh, then I'm generating energy, and this energy must 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 go backwards, and 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 so uh, that's why I've added here this uh, the mode pin and the DC out, and uh, basically it would be uh, very easy because they only made seven point headers to for stability of this uh, pickup module. Uh, there's a lot of copper here on the right side, but here uh, on this. Uh, the side, I think it, it would be quite easy to modify it here to allow uh, additional uh, useful inputs if this uh, display here, if this one doesn't uh, have, uh, don't have it here, but if it's they are empty here on this pickup module, it would even be compatible. So, uh, at the first thing, if you have some idea how to uh, find this uh, manufacturer of, of these knives. There are several sellers here, but it's in from it's hard from from Germany to to really find the the, the manufacturer of this thing, uh, so that he might be willing to do some changes. And yes, it should could be a 100 pieces Kickstarter. Uh, only this. Uh, uh, pickup module here and uh, one thing uh, that's also strange uh, um, this um, ESP S2 mini here as uh, a second DAC is not working 
that's why I had to make a low pass. I don't know the, the values yet, but I think it was something like again 10 kilo ohm output, like for the input. And here was, I think it was something like 50 nanofarad. And it took an oscilloscope and, and choose some different resistors and capacitors until my uh, frequency uh, uh, was enough to, to, to get a, a smooth. Uh, constant uh, digital output uh, that's this pin 18 this should be a DAC but uh, the, the seventh pin is, is not it's always on if you send out uh, of, of zero then uh, it's uh, one, 127 so it starts from half voltage so you can only make half voltage from one point uh, six to three point two uh, but the middle pin as uh, a voltage of the LTC uh, eight LT eight seven oh five is 1.2 voltage and and so um, this this is it's not possible and so I, I simply here did choose uh, oh where is it that's the code this is the code of the my MPPT uh, which has uh, an, still in a little OLED display and not this touch screen but I had to upload some code so that's uh, how I generate my second uh, output and yeah there is boards out there that have four potentiometers and I also would like to uh, find, find this guy from, from China who made this uh, because you see if, um, then I would uh, we wouldn't use these um, 8 bit uh, these two uh, DAC but uh, uh, I to C 4 channel 12 bit uh, DAC and then we could um, manipulate all everything not only the output voltage but also output current and input code might be possible ah uh, yeah here that's the thing that I'm also um, not <laughs> very happy uh, I, I this here I, LED, I, I drive uh, with 3.3 uh, uh, volt because you see uh, 5 volt and the MOSFET and only controlled by 3.3 volt that's a problem and so here I, I made a voltage divider and, and so if this is set to high so 3.3 volt then because of the voltage divider this is uh, 0.51 volt below this 5 volt and so the p-channel is still closed if I set it to ground, uh, then it's pulled uh, 1.5 voltage b uh, below. And uh, okay, let's turn off the uh, hoverboard. Uh, uh, b b b so minus 1.5, and then it opens, and then we have the full 5 volt here on this uh, touchscreen uh, LCD. Maybe there's a better uh, way to, to do it. And 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 I think uh, I also hear these uh, these lines. They are not really very nice because. Uh, you see it, it might be better only to work with labels because because now you see these uh, lines for the for this jog dial they they have to go uh, around and and here we have three digital outputs but they now have to go to the display so uh, it might be better here to only work with labels and, and so that you can really quickly reassign here with, with M, uh, so, some some uh, uh, points Okay, a quick look outside. Ah. It had been uh, quite stormy uh, on, on the last days. And so I always found found a place where to, to shield from, from, from the wind. Uh, but now the sun's coming out and so I think I will move it here a bit. Yeah. Uh, as I said, I'm an absolute beginner with, with KiCad and, and so uh, most of the wiring and, and the, the, I use this uh, KiCad um, uh, auto, auto PCB auto router. Uh, a plugin didn't show you quite easy. You simply install the plugin and then click on, on tools and, and auto quick route and, and you're done. Uh, but I don't know if this is really any good. And I think I first uh, pass, I should order without assembly of this SMD because I've chosen the 0805, this, which are easy to solder by uh, manually. And so to um, check the, the PCB, I guess I should uh, order without assembly. 
And I think I have to order 10 and they are very small, so I will end up with <laughs> lots of PCBs I don't don't need. Uh, and, and therefore, uh, if you're from somewhere in Europe, uh, you might uh, have have one of the PCBs. And uh, you, I, I put it online on GitHub so you can fork it, download, make uh, modifications to the PCB and the circuit. And, and because, as I said, uh, absolute beginner. <laughs> But, as I said, uh, not much happiness here. Uh, so, so, <laughs> the happiness to, to uh, finally uh, started with, with PCB and, and the circuits. Yeah. And, and I, I should really uh, make a video on, on my peace plan. So, so, so many things. Uh, but, but I've really by now understood that the Western world is totally evil and, 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 and so. Really, why, why should I make this video for, for you fucking sucking evil guys and, and this idea to go to China, but um, the news lately with, with China is, is these political leaders say also um, are, are egoist, egoistic and, and so really I, I don't know um, how, how to proceed and so uh, yeah, okay, PCB, keycard, Christmas. And bye-bye.